what is going on guys moonshot gaming here today we are back with another video on the channel today guys we have episode number zero of our new series stub squad you know shelfie's got pack squads coos has got angel in the outfield mighty goat he's got poppy's playground we got stub squad so if you guys don't know what any of those series are pretty much it is a diamond dynasty series where we start with the team of all commons, and we're going to play games and level up our team um, until it's eventually all diamond. For sub stop, for sub squads, how it's going to work is we're going to start, so we're not going to have one single player. The entire team is going to be bronze, and here are the upgrades and downgrades right here. Um, every time we score a run, we'll get 1,000 stubs. Every time we hit a home run, 1,000 more stubs. A hit is 100, a walk is 50, a pitching strikeout is 50. A win is 200, and a rage quit is 200. Um, now, I haven't really explained the stubs yet, so we're going to have a stub bank. Um, so those are the upgrades. The downgrades are every time we throw a walk is 50, minus 50 stubs. An error in the field is minus 100. If we, every, for every five guys we leave on base, minus 100. And if we get mercy, minus 100. So we're going to have a stub bank. Now, that stub bank, at the end of, or at the beginning of every episode, we're going to come over to the community market, and we're going to use our stubs and we're going to buy players with it pretty much. So if we say one game we win one nothing with one hit, we would get the 1,000 for the run, 200 for the win, and 100 for the hit. So that's about 1.3. So we could go in and buy Luis Severino for 1,000, or we could come down and buy a lot more like silvers and bronzes. Um, but that's how the community market works. Now there are some cards in MLB The Show that are not on the community market. So that's where this next thing comes in. For any non-community market cards, if they're a gold, so like this attains for like the XP reward path cards, like any cards that cannot be found on the market. So any cards in the collection, like you come down, like I'm just gonna choose one. This Cody Allen 88, he cannot be found in the market. Um, the player programs, any of those cards are gonna qualify for this non-community market cards. Um, any gold is we can buy for 1,500. Any 85 overall diamond we can buy for 5,000. Any diamond between an 86 and 88 we can buy for 8,000. Any 89 through 91, 10,000. Any 92 through 94, 15,000. 95 through 97, 20,000. And then a 98 or a 99, 30,000 stubs. Um, now, those are the ways we can get cards. Now, how we're actually making the choices. You guys can leave me comments down below of who you think I should be picking up, but I'm mostly going to be choosing, you know, just cards that I think we can add, nice additions to the team. Um, speaking about the team, let's go over the team. So in left field, we have Dwight Smith Jr. In center field, we got Jonathan Davis. Right field, we got John Jay. First base, we got Martin Prado. Second base, we got Isan Diaz. Shortstop, we have got Isaac Perda. Or that's not, that's our third baseman. Our shortstop is... um. Hey, Jason Guzman, I think. Our third baseman, Isaac Paredes. Dom Nunez behind the plate. On our bench, we got Christian Stewart, Jacoby Jones, Derek Fisher, Lewis Brinson, and Tomas Nito. Um, and then for pitching, we've got um, Jeff Hoffman, James Kapperlane, uh, I don't know how to pronounce this guy's name, Bruce Garthol, but he can throw a 99 mile per hour fastball, so that's like really good. Um, Edwin Jackson and Franklin Kilome. Um, and then in our bullpen, we got Harlan Garcia, Jason Bradford, Corey Garbin, Anton or Antello, or it's Aniel Gomez, Fernando Salas. And I know some of you guys are going to say this is unfair. We got the knuckleballer, Ryan Fairben. Um, we need some way to keep us in these games, so we'll use the knuckleballer. And then we got Johnny Venters in the bullpen. Um, so that is the starting team. You guys now know how we can upgrade the team. Um, and that's pretty much all for episode zero here. Um, episode number one is going to go up on Saturday, I believe. So if you want to see episode one, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>